Oh god, to spawn and then immediately get knifed. Oh, that hurts. That one's a hurt. Oh, that hurt. Okay, no. We're not taking this that seriously. Hi, and welcome to episode 106. Thank you, Tree. Fun Field, a show about the fun Battlefield offers where you don't care who wins or who you team kill. This week's episode you features for myself, me Dan, aka New Destroy Man, and Drew, aka Avalon Drew. On this week's mini so Drew starts murdering people with the M4, we figure out what sniper rifle is one shot on hardcore, and I make bitter enemies with- All the tree left! No, that was my cover! Oh, team killed. An awkward moment when I don't realize I have two bullets in the gun. Yeah. Oops. I'm no, like don't kill me. bugging out. My character is wigging. What the hell is going on? As I stand in the building, my teammates are trying to bring down around me. Guys, we have lost objective alpha. Seriously, it's a fence. I just want to be able to jump over it. Not allowed. So you take more because I fucking said so, and because I really wanted to get that squad basic or support basic thing. How many people are over there? Jesus Christ! I can't believe the M4 gets a fucking grip. It's so good. He doesn't need a grip. No, it doesn't. But that doesn't mean you shouldn't have one. Yeah. You get a grip. And you get... I'm waiting to see when the big grip nerf will happen. Because I feel like it has to. Well, I like every... All it does is improve, like, there's no downsides to having a grip. Yeah, whereas there clearly was in Battlefield 3. Yeah. It was just there. Okay, but I killed him back, and that's all that matters. Again, this game is not great at showing you exactly when someone's a friendly or not. I, I really want to know, yeah. by the end of Battlefield 3, like, bah, Battlefield 4, how many people I've shot because of that. Like, well, I shot them because I didn't know they were friendly. Mm. The problem with it being hardcore is they die so fast that you don't have time to, to rectify your mistake. Yep. Well, especially, like, sniping, you put one round in the guy and they're, they're dead. Oh, speaking of getting slammed. Actually, uh, which sniper rifles are one shot kill in hardcore? I don't know, actually. Um, granted, I only have one unlocked, so. Uh, the, the base one will, at the very least. Hey, soldier, where are you going? You know, getting the 10 point suppression assist is like, I, especially with a sniper rifle, it's like, congratulations, you can't aim for shit. There's a guy there. <laughs> Waiting for him to come around the corner. Come on. Okay, now he's dead. There you go. <laughs> Just neutralized objective Charlie. Oh, we have taken objective Charlie. Oh, 
good. My parachute feels like working this round. That's delightful. Do you have ammo for me? I was going to say, if I can get some health, yes. Yes, I do. Oh, the water effects are so good. It's beautiful. I seem to remember us saying that about Battlefield 3, too. That, and I quote, Qual thought the water was so beautiful, he just wants to go take a bath in it right now. Just eat the pixels. <laughs> oh, that's teammate. Just let him up. I don't even know where the guy was that killed me. Shit. Oh, whoa, what the hell is going I was firmly in some enemy territory there. You just hear the sounds of people badly aiming all around you. I was about to say, can I do it? But then I spawned into a grenade. <laughs> so the that answer happens. is a resoundingly no, I cannot. <laughs> no. Dreams are for some people, just not for me. <laughs> oh, sorry for. I may have tagged you a couple times through. <laughs> I'm gonna blow myself up, but it's totally worth it. You blew me up with you! Okay, let's see. You're not gonna get yelled at for running in this one. Oh, good. They said that they had an alternate server where you could run if you were under fire and going to cover. I'm like, that makes it better? So I'm not sure how I died there before the guy in front of me died. It's as if the bullets went through him, hit me, but apparently I have not so stern constitution as him, and I died first. I wonder how often in like real war you legitimately have scenarios like what just happened to me where you die and you kill the guy with you. I'm sure it's happened. I don't understand how that wasn't killing him. I was shooting right through the goddamn bars. You know, this is actually where I wish I had a hit marker to know if I could do that. <laughs> yeah. Is Dan wasting ammo in a futile effort to kill a guy? Oh. <laughs> I just took a fucking face plant. Did that, like, include you dying as well, or did you just... Yeah. Okay. Face planted as I was... Just... Pfft, splattered my face all over the ground. It was, was great. I was pointing earlier, and, like, my, my parachute was refusing to deploy on, like, the flood level. Where I'm jumping off, like, the third level of the favela and trying to land on the ground and, like, dead every time. kind of given up on defibs. <laughs> Man, well, maybe what, if, if we start like switching over to like conquest or stuff, I might do it more, but right now in domination, you yeah. respawn so quickly. It's like, I don't care. Yeah. It's nice for the points when you do get it, though. Woo! Arbitrary metal. Sure like that M4. It's very nice, isn't it? Yeah. I 
I was at the crossroads of a moment. Do I decide to try and knife as many people as I can, or do I just open up on the machine gun? <laughs> I went with the louder. Well, I, I knifed one guy, and then I went with the louder option afterwards. 